Patients have a lot of uh, anxiety when they're referred to a neurosurgeon. I think there's a lot of misconceptions floating around. And, uh, you know, I, I think one of the things that everybody uh, doesn't really quite understand is just because you're coming to see a neurosurgeon doesn't necessarily mean you need surgery. And, you know, we work through that together and we kind of explain the process. And a lot of patients don't need surgery that come and see me. And, you know, they're still up and moving and happy and are able to regain their life again. I think one of the misconceptions today about uh, surgery is there's a misconception that people will be laid up in bed for about six months after surgery. We have a lot of uh, new techniques that we can do, minimally invasive techniques, that we don't have to do as much muscle dissection and we're not doing as large surgeries. But the advantage of this is many patients are up walking the next day. And, you know, it's a type of case where, you know, in two weeks you'll be off pain medication, be able to go back to work in six weeks. But uh, I think the misconception that I won't be able to move for six months and will just be in bed with somebody taking care of me is, is a, a little bit of the past. So one of the things that I, I like about working at uh, Southern New Hampshire Medical Center is that uh, we're a very collaborative team. Uh, my partner, Dr. Wen, and myself, we are both uh, well-trained in doing brain tumors. We have the latest technology to add for neuronavigation during the procedures. We work directly with the oncologist. We can get the same uh, genetic staining and uh, treatment for after surgery with the advantage of being close to home and close to family and friends. So patients really come out of that, really enjoying that and just uh, really appreciative of the fact that they can get high quality care right here at home.